Hey everybody, hope you're doing well today. I have not pulled out the old faithful, the old whiteboard to do a training in a long time. This is, this is well overdue. So I got this bad boy out of the closet and I want to tell you a story today about two different contractors and two different paths of success that they can go down. Joe, I love telling stories. The stories make sense. And I think that it's imperative. Anybody out in the marketplace that wonders what we're doing at Improvify and how we're helping contractors understand the story. Because we're doing something different than perhaps what you're doing right now in your business from a lending perspective for home improvement contract financing. So let's talk about Joe. Joe, um, Joe saw an ad on Facebook and it said, no dealer fee. So Joe got excited because of this ad and said, oh my God, I heard that dealer fees are just the worst thing in the world for contractors and I'm going to get enrolled with this, this company because they don't offer dealer fees and my life's going to be perfect because I went to their website and it just, it's got all these bullet points and it says it's got these products and these, these features and these benefits and I don't have to pay dealer fees and my gosh, my customers are going to love this financing thing. Because while I know I need to offer a payment option at the point of sale, and if I don't have to pay dealer fees, and it's a soft credit call, oh my gosh, I'm going to do so well. So let's talk about what happens with Joe. Joe pays this company. There's, there's two of them that really stick out. They pay them an amount of money, and then this company gives them this tech platform. And this tech platform allows them to take an application through a tool. And then from that tool, it takes the application, it sends it off to a whole bunch of personal loan entities, personal loan lenders, where you can honestly go right now directly and take your customer's application, they can apply absolutely free. So in essence, you never really even had to hire this tech company and pay them any money to do this. You could send them to these personal loan entities where the customer could apply with a soft credit pull, and they can get some money if they qualify. And then hopefully they pay you when the job's installed. You've essentially taken your customer and sent them somewhere so they can get some money. And then you're trusting the fact that they're going to pay you at install. Okay. So these companies brag about no dealer fees and they're going to charge you an annual fee. And their churn rate is 97%. That means people just literally give them one year and they never go back. Why? Well, here's why. Your customers, let's say you have a customer that have a 741 credit score. He goes to this personal loan entity thing that says no dealer fees. That you were pitched on really well from a group. He's going to stare down the barrel of anywhere between 19.99% and 36% interest rate for a five to seven year term. <laughs> your credit, your customer that has super prime credit, the 741 FICO is going to be staring at a 19 or 20% to a 36% interest rate for five to six years, five to seven years. Horrible. This is called direct to consumer financing. You're taking your customers, you're putting them in this tool. They're sending them to personal loan lender entities that are charging high interest rates for short terms with a low approval. The approvals are horrible. They say that they're going to fund people with a 500 credit score. They are not telling you the truth. And if they are, the rates are criminal. And they're going to probably get $2,000 to $3,000 at 45%. It's absolutely criminal. That's what this is. That's scenario number one. This is called direct-to-consumer. These entities exist. They pitch you on an ad that says, we don't charge dealer fees. We offer a soft credit pull. We have a mobile app. We'll enroll anybody with a heartbeat. There's no qualifications whatsoever to get this. If you have money, you can sign up for this right now and offer this horrible financing solution to your customers at the point of sale. Right now. They'll even put a link on your website. Why? Well, because they're making... 500 to 600 basis points on these loans. Yeah. So your customer with a 741 over here with Scoville and Improvify, 
should be looking at 7.49% between a two and a 20 year term. I would say that's better. Not great. Next scenario, Joe offers financing with an unsecured merchant direct lending. And Joe has got some college kid at a, um, at a cubicle and that's his account manager. You guys, this kid's never sold at the point of sale. It, all he does is call this contractor, say, where's your loans? Why aren't you selling the six months same as cash? Which, by the way, the dealer fee on that is, is unbelievable. The dealer fee is those six month and the 12 month, the 18 month, the 24, the equal pay, no interest, are, are up near 15, 17%. So this guy's calling you and badgering you. Why aren't we your first look lender? Why aren't you offering promo loans? Why aren't you offering a product suite of X, Y, and Z and, and offering this product at every single sit? Why? Because, well, this lender is going to make a ton of money off of those high dealer fees that are built into it. Now, I can train you on why this, is, this works. However, this guy ain't going to train you. What else don't they have? They don't have a training facility center that teaches everybody in your organization how to offer and sell financing. All they do is enroll you and then ask you for your business over and over and over and over and over and over. And then they also will badger you if you're working with other lenders and you're not putting them in the first position. And then if you don't give them enough business, they also have the ability to kick you out of the program. We saw that this year with one, one particular lender. They kicked a ton of people out. During frozen tundra season, up in Minnesota, when there was no business going on, and the lender called out to these roofers, I know that they enrolled in this guy, and they said, hey, you're not using our finance program, we're kicking you out. It's unbelievable. Now this is the best lending, by the way. Indirect lending, this type of lending is what you need. However, this lender, not good. No training, no sales rep that knows what they're doing, badgering you for your business, high dealer fees. You don't need that. Two scenarios that Joe could go through. Not great, not great, but at least this is better than that. So what's the difference? Well, we do, let's say we do three things really, really well here at Improvify. Number one, we will enroll you with the best lending solutions, unsecured. So that's number one. Number two, we will enroll you and give you the best secured lending. And then number three, training. So if I had to sum up the three things and I'll, I'll break these down now. I know my handwriting is atrocious, but it helps me frame work how, what I need to educate you on here. We're going to enroll you with the best proprietary and Provify lending partner to suit your needs in your business. That's why we do an intake to understand what it is that you need. Because not all contractors are created equal. I just got off the phone with a roofer in Indiana. He's going to be using our finance platform for deductibles and repairs. He doesn't need a big, huge system. He doesn't need progress pay. He just needs the ability to offer a finance solution at the point of sale with a mobile app with a soft credit pool so he can get his customers covered on deductibles and repairs. What will happen is after we enroll him and get him this financing, he'll take the training and realize, wow, I'm missing out. I can actually be making this financing a bigger part of my business by advertising and marketing it and doing retail full replacement with this. I won't force him. I'm going to give him what he needs because that's what his problem was. And we're going to solve for that right now. And that's where we're going to take it. So he's going to enroll and we're going to be able to give him financing from two to 20 years, from 2000 to 150,000 unsecured, Soft credit pull, FICO's from 600 credit score, and we're going to do this all with only a 2% flat dealer fee. Big difference. 
19 to 36%. Unbelievably high dealer fees, low approvals, badgering college rep with a headset on that's never sold home improvement. We're going to take John through an entire process. We're going to get him enrolled with Unsecured. We're going to get him in his portal set up. He's going to have two account managers plus us on the outside to support him and train him to make his entire team successful. And then we're going to go the added step and we're going to give him secured funding. Why does he need secured funding? Well, once John starts selling financing, he's going to come into some customers that are like, hey, John, we got a big project. We'd really prefer to use the equity in our home to do this. Can you help us out? John's going to have the ability now to offer a secured lending solution at the point of sale as well. So if the customer doesn't want unsecured, they want to use the equity in their house because they want to do debt consolidation. They want to use some money for the home improvement. I don't know. And maybe they want to build a pergola out back. Just something, an outdoor living space. They want the egg. Who cares what it is? John's going to be able to provide unsecured and secured lending solutions at the point of sale. There's no dealer fees at all with my secured lending, which goes from $15,000 all the way up to $400,000 at the point of sale. How else can secured lending help? It can help stop the customer from going to a bank. Why in the world would you ever want to stop a customer from going to the bank? Oh, I don't know. Maybe because they're brushing you off and it's a hidden objection that they want you out of the house. They've got your bid. They've got the number. Now they need to know. Now they know what they need to go beat. So if they go down to their local bank and they get a loan, a personal loan or a HELOC or a home, just some type of a loan, they now have your bid and they can go call any customer, any contractor out there that's your competitor. So by John offering the secure loan solution from the mobile app with a soft credit pull at the point of sale within five minutes, he can lock down the contract for services with the approved funding. That's why we provide you unsecured secured. And that's why more importantly, we give you the training program to learn how to sell this, offer this, and close more. Our training program is not just for John. John has lifetime access to it. His entire team has lifetime access to the training platform that we built. The owner, the CFO, the CMO, everybody can come in, the sales managers, any of the reps, any of the techs, any of operations, Becky from the front desk, need to know the basics of financing for your customer. Why does Becky need to know? Because if Becky answers the phone and the customers say, hey, we're looking for this home improvement. We understand that it's expensive because of the rising cost of the economy and the cost of goods. We're hoping that you guys have a finance program because we really like we really like low monthly payment options. Or we'd really like 12 months same as cash. Who cares how the call goes? If Becky doesn't know at least three talking points to get that customer in to get John out there to the bid, you're going to, you may lose the job. And what the customer is simply going to do is hang up. They're going to go to Google and they're going to call the next one. And they're going to say the same thing until someone says, absolutely. When John comes out, he can present the financing solutions that we have. It's a soft credit pull. We offer 100% financing. We've got promos from 12 to 18 months, same as cash. And we can definitely, definitely entertain and help you out with a low monthly payment option. When can John come on out? Big difference. So when, when contractors call us and they say, hey, Chris, what, what is Improvify? I get to offer them this whole thing here. A big value stack. A big, big, big value stack is, well, I've been doing this for over 25 years. I built the training out of the knowledge that I've had in the industry for the industries that I've helped build. We've secured the best unsecured lenders in the United States of America out there right now with the lowest dealer fees, the longest terms, progress pay, up to 150,000 unsecured, 600 credit scores, 2% dealer fee. And then there's no dealer fee on the secured lending. So this entire offer is what you get to offer when you work with us at Improvify. Or you could just simply follow the ads on social media and then roll over here and pay these people $2,000 to $5,000 and you'll only be with them for one year. You won't re-enroll. Or you can go to this lender over here that charges you absolutely nothing to get enrolled with their platform and hope and pray that this kid right here, this account manager, can actually train you on how to do all the things that we do. Market it, advertise it, objection, selling, seven steps of sales success, 
um, the go-to-market uh, training strategy sessions, countless, countless podcasts and information inside of our training program, and, and then hope that you're positioning them as a first-look lender so you don't get that phone call, and then hope that you're presenting the right programs and products so they don't kick you out of the program, or hope that you're giving them enough business that they don't treat you like a second-class citizen for enrolling in their, in, their, in their lending platform. It's crazy. I've seen it all. I get phone calls from contractors every day on this, and it blows my mind how rude they're being to contractors. It's just, it's literally epic what's happening out there in the home improvement industry. So, yeah, I wanted to tell the two stories about Joe and about John. I think it's quite evident that John's going to have great success. He's got training for himself and his entire, and his entire team. So, at, to educate, dominate, he will win because he's trained. And he knows what to sell at, the, sell at the point of sale and how to present it properly and position it. And he's going to have the best programs from unsecured and secure to answer the customer's questions and be able to provide the proper solution to the customer's questions and problems that they have, whether unsecured works or secured works. And then there's so many features and benefits with each one of these. I, I could go on, but I don't want to do features and benefits today. I wanted to tell the story of Joe and John and what the difference is and how John will succeed and be profitable and have better margins and his p &L will look better and he's got better training and better marketing and advertising because we've got an entire marketing audit process inside of our consulting group as well. And then Joe over here, he'll, he'll be, he'll come, he'll come to me next year because he's going to come with the same story that I hear all the time. And these guys will eventually just leave that lender because they have nothing sticky. They haven't created a relationship, and they created zero value. All they've done is provide a financing solution here. So that's the story. If you have any questions, reach out. We can hop on a one-on-one, -on -one and I can break down exactly what we're doing in Provide to help contractors grow. I'll give you a sneak peek of the university and the, uh, the training center that we built. I'll show you the matrix for unsecured, and I'll show you the matrix for secure. So you can actually see all the cool features and benefits of it, and then we'll go from there. So, hey, thanks for checking this training out. I hope this helps. Um, the contractors that are looking between different lending solutions and wondering why they should actually hire us to work with them because you're going to get all this. So cool. Um, thanks. We'll see you at the next one. Have a great day.